So, uh, as I was saying, last night he went live on Marty's stream. We thought he would say something different, and it turned out that it's just going to be the same uh, nonsense where he claims Marty uh, killed some some girl or something like that, and. Uh, just a whole bunch of gibberish, a whole bunch of nonsense. Um, not really anything too interesting, but we'll see. We'll see how long I can last listening to this. You know, I can say my interest is solely in what could Mr. Wilkins say that is remotely interesting. I haven't been watching him. I don't know what he's been up to. And that's the fact. Um, oh, wow, and here he is, okay. Hey, Cyrax, what's going on? Marty, the time is coming. I like, uh, Marty's, uh, name on StreamYards. It's funny. Come for you to be exposed for your sexual deeds. For my sexual deeds? You know what I'm talking about. <laughs> okay, well, my... Uh, how about you, you explain the truth <laughs> about how you music this, Marty? He looks so high right now. A.K. Nicholas Beagler. Yeah. You sat there. Explain to them, to the people, how you sat there and catfished me for pornographic videos that you then posted up on sites like this. Hey, your yeah, I, I, shut up and listen, boy. <laughs> I'm exposing you, Marty. What this is. is Cyrix versus pepperoni. Oh yeah, gay porn berries. Oh my goodness, 11.3 million views. Wow, Cyrix. Is what you do. Do you see this, everyone? Is this it? is what Marty did. Is and it? the reason why that video is not up anymore. I've managed to get it removed several times. And there's more sites like this all over the internet. This right here, ladies and gentlemen, is proof that Music Biz Marty <laughs> is a terroristic, pedophilic monster. I don't, I don't understand where he gets the pedophilic part from, but um, does he think he's in court right now? This, ladies and gentlemen, of the jury is why music biz marty is this this and this what is he doing what is he doing Stress, oh shit shut up nick oh <laughs> oh so yeah i was gonna ask you is the time you shove the fix spinner down your dick a stylus up your ass or stuff down your pee holes no it's the time you jerked off of pepperoni you see, there's so many. Why don't you tell the truth, Marty? Uh, Why don't you turn off? Put your goddamn mouth out. Why don't you turn your goddamn camera on, you fake? So who's you the real fake ass motherfucker? Come on, boy. Face me like a man, Marty. Who's the real sexual? Come on, boy. Face me like a man, you piece of shit. What last Let's time face Remember what happened last time? Oh, he said that. I forgot. Hey, Marty, you done how it? How it? Remember, remember it happened the last time I faced like a man? Oh, I remember. Your nose still looks fucked up. How many people have you done this to, Marty? I didn't even do this. Ah, yes, you did, and oh, you know it. You, you know you did, Marty. Well, okay. I have to have you didn't do it. How does a man make another man jerk off pepperoni, Cyrax? That's my question to you. Like, how does this play out? There's so many videos, too. You think you would learn by some point. The answer is very simple, Nick. It's called you fucking blackmailed me, oh. and you sat there and catfished me, and you know it. And you know how. You know exactly how. Now, let's be honest, Marty. If you weren't gay for me, then why do I still have that screenshot of what you said to your ex, Violet, about how you were gay for me, and how if I didn't do what you wanted to do, yeah, like you that I could live on the streets in a ditch or die somewhere. This is the last time uh, Marty uh, faced him like a man. He was, he was going down the alley. Uh. 
Oh, my face you is win. covering it. You win. Leave us go. I think you Why is it that I have proof of you saying they're saying that yeah, you either want me dead, in exist. prison, or in a psych ward because I didn't do what you want? And the answer is simple, Marty. That's because you are a terrorist cult leader. Okay. You're a piece of shit. Mm. You're a fucking <laughs> asshole who needs to be exposed, Marty. You're a piece of shit. So in your mind, you showing a link to a video of you jerking off a pepperoni somehow exposes me. Wow, Cyrus. Okay. Yeah. Oh, it that, does. That, that makes and sense. More, and more than certainly does, Marty, because yeah. you're the one that catfished me into doing it. All those fake I accounts. All, all... Who made an, Who made you do that, Chance? Who made you do that? You, like, did somebody hold a gun up to your head? I was like, Chance. You better fucking do this, or I'm gonna fucking. What? 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 You look like you enjoyed it. All those fake girls, Marty. Ring the bell, Marty. All those fake. All those people that you pretended to be. All of those people that you set up and pretended to be. Just to get videos on me, <laughs> so that you can do your sick, twisted uh... little bullshit. And Marty's laugh is infectious. Up. And let's be honest, Marty, it wasn't nobody else because around them. So, you're claiming I'm a sexual deviant because there's videos of you jerking off a pepperoni, shoving pens up your ass, eating the pepperoni, <laughs> shoving things down your pee hole. Like, in what world does this make any sense, Cyrax? For one, to tell you the truth, it wasn't even me, but I did receive it. I did enjoy watching it as well. You can feel everyone through about that. Marty, you don't get it, do you? Yeah, it's pretty no, uh, it's disgusting. You really fucking don't get it. It wasn't nobody else but you, Nick. Because around that time, William... Why is it always Marty's fault? Why? Why Why can't there be other people that hate you? There's thousands of people that hate you, Cyrex. Thousands. Literally thousands. But it's always Marty. <laughs> it's always Marty. Marty controls all these thousands and thousands of people. Yeah. Glory Hole wasn't around. CBG wasn't around. None of the other trolls were around, so who else could it be? So, Cyrax. Who else could it be? I'd ask you this. How do you fall for this so many fucking times? Like, even Back then, it was at least, like, 50. 50 to 100 people who probably watched in the shadows. Um, a bunch of... Juggalos, juggalos are spiteful. Um, they, they got you, dude. It, it, you, you fell for the okie doke. You fell for the old okie doke. Talk to the woman. Do you even hear a woman's voice? Like, I would hope that you did. I know one person that got all the fidget spinner stuff. Um, I know who did that. I can tell you who does these things. And you know what's funny, Marty? Yeah. Every time that kind of shit pops up, yeah, it's pretty odd. That you're at the helm of the blackmailing list when it... it just falls into his lap. What do you expect? He's he's your number one troll. People do this to you and then they send it to him because they know that he is the best at exposing you for for this. Like he can handle it better than a lot of these trolls. These trolls can get you to do these things, but when it comes to interacting with you and talking to you and putting you on stream, Marty's king at that. Sorry to say. It comes to me. Well, of course How many people have you blackmailed, Marty? How many? 
how do I, so uh, how many people before me? So I tell you this: that if I was the head of all of this, and there's multiple victims, who else have I made jerk off with pepperoni? Who else have I made people shove things up their ass? Like name one other person. You can't. Right. You the can't. The denominator in all this is you. You're the one who constantly does this because you're a sick fuck. No, the common denominator here is you, Marty. Oh, you the, pathetic you. scumbag. He won't see it. Shit. He doesn't it's see you. it. You're the common denominator, Marty. You he's never. Prostitute. He's never in the wrong. See, there he goes again. He's never in the wrong. He's the one that shoves things in his pee hole. But no, no, it's it's. <laughs> <laughs> it's the trolls that made him do it, but he likes it. He's got a humiliation fetish that his ex-girlfriend proved that and 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 uh, what's it called? Confirmed it. You yeah. yeah, killed Jamie. You blackmailed me. You yeah. extorted me. No, no, shut the fuck up and listen up, you fucking pedo. You extorted yeah. me for those videos. I was be honest, buddy. Yep. There's a video of you on fucking. Video. So look, expose me, how does this process play out? Like, how did I talk you into jerking off a pepperoni? Because I don't remember it. Tell all these people how that scenario plays out. I'm sure they're genuinely curious. I really, yeah, I, I really want to know that, Chance. I really wanted to know that last night. I really wanted to figure out how this happens to you every time. What, what, how did they get you to do this? How did, what? How to? How do they get you to do this? That's the thing, Marty. You say you don't, but you remember, because you're just trying to worm your way out of there like a little bitch. What's He's the embarrassed. Matter, Marty? You mad because myself and my team are fighting back against you? What's the matter, Nicholas Bitchler, faggot bitch, Marty, pedo bitch, Marty, sandwich bitch eater, Marty, sandwich eater, Marty. Marty. So why are you here? Killer Marty, sick fuck bitch Marty, pedo looking motherfucking bald ass cue ball bitch. The dumb fuck. Cyrix. Cyrix. What? Who thinks he's a. What's that? What? What? what what's that? What's that? What's that? You know what's that? funny about you, Marty? Cue ball. You think that you're a tough guy. You ain't shit, you fat fucking tub of lard. I mean, look at you. You're 300 pounds, bro. You think I'm gonna waste your goddamn life away? You sat there and had a woman pretending to be a child, and then you sat there and told them to take their clothes off, which. I what? What's. What? What? I said this last night, but what? Where did he get this from? When did this happen, Sarex? When did this happen? We don't know this. you for? So you're saying that when you sent your penis picture, that the child took their clothes off for you? What are you talking about? What's the matter, Nick? No, I'm curious here. Elaborate here. Yeah, what are you please. About here? Please. Tell the truth, Nick. You ain't curious. You're just playing stupid. No. You're playing. Not. So look, yeah, of course I'm well aware of all this stuff, so why don't you tell everyone here what happened? You're not just now aware of all this. You've been aware of this motherfucker. Yeah, oh yeah, I'm totally aware. Why don't you tell everyone then what happened so you can expose me? King pattern of what you do. And stop fucking muting me. Oh well, no, I want you to explain you know, yeah, no, you are. Dude, You're just, mad because I'm ex He's skirting around it because he can't explain it. He can't explain it because it's... it's it, It'll expose him because he... he Sent another penis picture to an underage girl. Another kid. Another fucking kid, dude. Exposing you. You're mad because I'm telling the truth of the shit that you blackmailed me into doing by phone. Sorry, Axe. How does somebody That's... blackmail another person into jerking off with pepperoni? Like, I'm genuinely curious. Uh, I mean, I'm sorry. I know, but these people are curious and they want you to expose me. You guys want the truth? Yeah. This fucking scumbag, music fucking bitch terrorist cult leader Marty, your fearless leader, mm -hmm. 
There's nothing more than a false prophet piece of shit. See, he can't this go. He just oh, what's the matter, Nick? You're mad. He can't explain. All he can do is just name call. He can't explain. He he's giving him the floor right here, but he's just he's just bullying him. He's just being rude and calling him names. Yep, that's how you know you 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 can win an argument because your only argument is calling a person names. Yep, makes sense. Because I'm exposing your fat. So expose me for the pepperoni thing, like, so that people will get a better understanding of how that plays out. You know what's funny, Marty? You say that you're not responsible for not ah, shut the fuck up and listen up, you faggot. Okay. And it's pretty funny how you said that said you're not responsible for all that shit. But yet, there's been tons of proof showing that you got hard on for me. There's been tons of proof. Dude, the only proof that we have is that you had a boner when you went and fought Marty. That you had a raging hard boner when you went and fought Marty. So I mean, it's pretty ironic how you have a hard That's on ironic. for me. Look, I, what I, what's ironic is you had a hard on when you went and fought Marty. That's what. That's what I. What, that's what's ironic. People know that, but I'm curious how a man makes another man jerk off with pepperoni. Hey, fat ass, stop fucking moving okay, yeah, and sit right, down right, and shut right, the fuck right, up, you right, fag right, motherfucker. Right, right. Sit down and shut your bitch ass up, you fat right. fuck. Yeah. Hey, why don't you go back? Shut your bitch ass up? Who, who's been watching Jimmy? Huh, somebody's been watching Jimmy lately. Come on, Burger King, you fat bitch. Hey, Other than that, how about you fucking hit the treadmill? Okay. How about you hit the goddamn treadmill for a few hours? You might fucking lose that fucking beer belt, you die, you drunk piece of... You drunk ass piece of shit. You're, you're getting, you're that's all you are. You're a drunk fucking tub of art. You're a piece of shit. And you're a pill popping drug. And we all know this, Marty. You're a fucking. Look, let's assume that those things were true. And you know, you might not be off base, especially the part about me being attracted to you. Oh, yeah. Um, Definitely. You got, you got him there. You got him there, Cyrex. Totally. Totally, you, Cyrex. <laughs> Assuming it might be true, yeah. more like it is true and you know it. You're just meeting me because you're afraid of the truth, ain't you, Nick? Rex, when you go to court, dude. <laughs> What's up with that fake forced laugh? You sound so that you're putting your your one and a half lung overtime, dude. You're gonna you're gonna bust it. So question. Oh, you're so delusional and you know it. You're not going to court. Oh, no, this is too good. You're now, now to shut the fuck up and don't mute me because I'm about to lay out all the facts, boy. Okay. Right. Y'all want to know the real fucking truth? Yeah. Let me fucking explain it to you. And I want y'all to think about this. Isn't it pretty strange how Marty sits there and claims that he doesn't know what I'm talking about? But yet, as you all know, you I've shown in the past the screenshots that he sent his ex, or the the messages that he sent his ex, Violet, by the way, shout out Violet, who then sent me the screenshots of you saying that you were gay for me, and that... So, have you ever considered that was bait, Cyrax? Oh, Marty, what's the matter, what's the matter, Nick? You don't want to hear the fucking truth. The truth hurt, fat fuck. The truth hurt, okay. Have you considered that was bait at any point? Oh, nope. what's the matter, Marty? You afraid of the fucking goddamn truth? You, you piece of shit. <laughs> you terrorist <laughs> cult leader looking motherfucker. You Taliban fucking looking asshole. Taliban looking motherfucker. You Osama Bin Laden looking little wannabe bitch. I mean, what are you? The what? next wannabe Osama Bin Laden? Yeah. Is that what you're trying to be? The next. He, see, all he can do is steal other people's material. He he's no originality, no creativity. He's nothing but a thief, a disgusting thief. Wanna be Osama? Sure. Like, come on, bro. You ain't no terrorist. You're a fat fucking cranky. What? You ain't no terrorist, or you are a terrorist? Oh man. You just said I was a terrorist. Like, make up your mind, you Cyrax. Oh, what's the matter, Nicholas Bitchler? Oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, that's not Nicholas Bitchler. That's Nicholas the Kitty Diddler. 
Nick was the fat. Oh, wow. Nick was the big. Wow. Nick was the fat ass. Nick was wow. the soft. I trust you. I know about how you fucking hire me to do your fucking work. The yeah. work that you can do your fucking self, but you're too fucking lazy to do. Do you remember that time that your grandma screamed at you for not doing the laundry and you said that your job in the house was keeping the trolls off her family's back? Do you remember that? The fucking truth. You guys want the truth? Marty, stop fucking meeting me right now. Because I'm getting tired of your fucking crap. These people want... <laughs> What's the matter, Nick? Fuck this guy. Get this pepperoni dick out again. Hey, Nick. Surprised you didn't. Why don't you go jerk off to that king porn you got on your computer, oh, bitch? That was you, dude. That was you. No, that was you. That was him. Right, let's be honest here, Marty. You're the one that can't handle the truth. That's why you're muting me. These no, people want the truth. Allow me to give them the truth. Okay. So, wait, all right, all right, all right. It'll make you look like the piece of shit that you are. I thought, oh, what's the matter, Nick? You afraid of getting fucking exposed? You afraid of me, motherfucker? Do it. You should be afraid. Because like I said, me and my team at Sneaky Jim, we're coming after that ass, boy. You know Sneaky Jim is not a real person, right? Like, they're... they're... You know what's funny, Nicholas Fagler? The yeah. fact that you have no honor, you have no respect. Yeah. You, you have no honor, you have no code, you have no respect for anything or anyone. I don't well, respect a guy who makes no money, who jerks off with pepperoni, who raped a blind kid, who strangled his grandmother, who's going to jail. Like, what's the respect Oh, about yeah, that? Blind Billy. How can anyone respect Blind you? Billy. You know what's funny, Marty? Unlike you. I don't have to sit there and resort to bullying and extorting people. You're, you're bullying me right now, sir. Totally sorry. is. Totally is. Marty, unlike you, I don't have to resort to extorting people for sexual images. Oh, so he admits he's bullying Marty. Ah, busted. Busted. To get money. That's you, motherfucker. Well, That's you. Cyrex the bully. You're yeah. a fucking pedo little bitch. Why do you Let's be here, Marty. You murdered three women. One of them who was a good friend of mine. Mm -hmm. Let's be honest here, Nick. You're a you druggie. Mean... You're a fucking drunk. You're lazy as fuck. You're a fucking... Good friend. You mean the one that you asked for nudes when she died? From Marty? You asked, you asked Marty for her nudes? That's how good of a friend you were, dude? Sick fucking freak. Fuck me, bro. At least when I dress up... I look good. When you dress up, you look like a wannabe fucking Oompa Loompa, man. Look at you. Sorry, Rex. Yeah, I mean, I'll admit you're a very handsome guy. Like, very, <laughs> that's, very stunning. That's a given. That's a given. I'll give you that. I'll give you that. Let's be honest here, Marty. Very stunning. You held your ex-girlfriend hostage good. in your yeah. own home, which, this, which she then had to make an excuse to get away from your ass. Why? Because you're a fucking murderer. You sent all of the Andy to my house to kidnap me so that you could then try to kill me because you knew damn well that I would expose you if I didn't. Let's be honest here, man. You sent... It's like... What? I often wonder, like, if you actually got sent away to a mental institute, which I think is going to be the ultimate court case, if you'd be able to, like, snap out of all this fantasy man stuff and realize there's this sad little man who has no talent, who makes no money, and it's just something that everybody laughs at. Like, I wonder if you could actually snap out of this mind frame that you're in. And to be honest, I think you're too far gone. He, he is too far gone, Marty. He, he, he's so wrapped up in his delusions that even when he's smacked in the nose with the hard truth, um, he can flip it around and turn it into a positive. He and it's not necessarily a good trait because he's ignoring reality and he lives in this fantasy land. And if it weren't for Sally taking care of him all his life, he would be homeless and on the streets or in a group home, um, which is not far off from his his very near future. 
Um, the only way that, like I said before, he's going to be able to prosper is if he doesn't respond to people on the internet, one, and two, a buddy troll steps in and, and helps him. Other than that, he's gonna he's gonna be fucked. He he's he's not gonna make it. He's gonna be on the streets or in a group home or in a mental institute. Those those are the three uh, futures I see for Cyrex. You know what's funny, Marty? You're a habitual liar. Really? You really are. You're a pathological, habitual liar, and you know it. What am I lying about? Everything. You what? never tell the truth about anything. What am I lying about? I mean, let's face it, Marty. I mean, it's pretty odd to me that how the minute I it. start exposing you, you send RV Andy after me. You send... I don't deal with those guys. So, Mr. Truth Teller, and I've been wondering about this. I saw this video the other day. Where's your Apple Watch at? No, let's discuss it. Where's, Where's your, your Apple Watch? Where's your $400 smart watch at? I'm just curious. Can you answer that one? I know you won't. I know you won't, but people have been asking. They're curious. And, you know what's funny? Yeah, you're, yeah. Or, yeah. You're a version of a time of saying, no, you're, shut the fuck right. up. Right. No, shut your bitch ass up, boy. Yeah. yeah. Shut your faggot, towelist, yeah. non rapper oh, ass whoa, up, bro. Whoa. Okay. Right, well, let's be honest here, Marty. Your version of a conversation is you victimizing a person and you getting them to do what you want. That's your version of a conversation. My version Can't of a conversation see. is the real version. Of yeah, your version of a conversation is screaming over people exactly. not answering any questions because you're too retarded to answer any questions. You can't handle the truth. Exactly. That's your version of a conversation. Now, what, what I'm going to do is this. Yeah, you're, right. First off, you're going to sit the fuck down and you're going to shut the fuck up and you're not going to mute me because... Right, right. <laughs> there it goes. Ah, what is he not going to do? I'm gonna lay out. What, what, what? What was that? Can't hear you. Why you mean me, bitch? You scared Can't me? Can't hear you. You pussy motherfucker. You scared? I'm scared of you. Oh, what's the matter? You don't want your people <laughs> knowing the truth, Marty. Oh. Yes. Everyone knows the truth about you, Cyrax. Every, I love that your initial argument is to expose me as a sexual deviant. You, you show me a link to a video of you jerking off with pepperoni. Like, how does that make sense? That's why you got caught swinging on a black dude, right? What? That's why you got caught swinging on a motherfucker. We all saw the video. That dude wasn't doing shit, and you swung on the poor guy. Ooh. Which, honestly, I'm surprised that motherfucker didn't beat your ass. Oh, what's the matter, Nick? Oh, Marty, I must have honest. missed something. You and I both know that if it comes down to a real fight, you can't do shit to beat me. Okay. You and I both. Thankfully, thankfully, I'm going to be there for your court date. So you'll have every opportunity. You'll have every opportunity, dude. No, you're not. I'm going to make damn sure that you're not there. Because I am going to explain to them what you've done to me and how you harass I'm me not, I'm not and how you go after me, you faggot-ass hey, motherfucker. Away, so and yes, I will have all the proof. I'm on away because you're going to get fucking hurt again. And Marty, do yourself yeah. a favor and yeah. fuck off and don't show up. Because if you do, your ass is going to jail, faggot. I promise you that. I promise you, you show up, it's a one-way ticket to prison time for your bitch ass. Big Bubba's gonna love them cheeks, Marty. Big Bubba's gonna love them cheeks. There he goes with that again. That's you, Cyrax. Cyrax is gonna be the one going to jail. I know for a fact that I ain't going to jail. I know. He totally is going to jail. He totally is. And what well, if even if he's not, I take that back. Even if he's not, he's going to get fucked. And he's going to. He's not gonna win. He's not. He's definitely not gonna win. We'll just we'll just leave it at that. Why ain't going to jail? Why? Dude, that ain't your goddamn business. You're talking to a troll who is acting as your lawyer. And you're so stupid, you actually fucking believe it. Do you try to run it? Every, this is something I've noticed about you, Marty. Every time somebody exposes you, you either mute them or you run and hide. Because you're scared of the truth. What's the because truth? you know damn well, if all your victims fought back, your ass would either be dead or in jail. 
Well, guess what? I'm going to be that motherfucker that make sure you end up in prison for the rest of your natural fucking life. For Why don't you just beat me to death? Right. Why not do that? Yeah, Marley, face it. You and I both know. Because you're like 4, 11, 85 pounds and weak. Oh, what's the matter, Marty? You afraid of myself in the shadow collective? Yeah. I don't even know what that is. I don't even know what that is. Oh, trust me. You'll find out soon enough. Oh, trust me. You'll find me. out soon enough. Oh, Marty, but trust you me. You're a piece of shit. What was his other little game called? Like, his, um, when he put on, like, the knight's mask and, and like, well, oh, dude. Fuck. Uh, <laughs> it was, uh... Project Project Ghostwire. Yeah, Project Ghostwire. You're so it fucking was. money drunk that you can't tell reality from fiction. What do you mean? You're so fucking drunk for money. That's why Sarah left your ass. Okay. That's yeah, why yeah. she left you. Oh, you're okay. a drunk piece of shit. You're a slob, and you don't give a fuck about anything else or anyone else Cutting except deep yourself there. and Cutting your deep. shitty bullying ass terroristic cult leader content. That's all you give a fuck about. Oh, by the way, your current girlfriend, I know for a fact, she's a fucking troll. Just like you. She's trolling you, motherfucker, and you don't even see it. You're but what's, like, what's the angle? Like, what's she getting out of it? Exposing the fuck out of you. Okay. Alright, <laughs> that makes a lot of sense. Alright, let's be honest here, Marty. Hey, I mean, it's pretty odd, Marty, that how every time someone exposes you, you try to do away with them. When, okay, like, so what's her end game here? Do you? Well, what, like, what, what's the end game here? Like, can you fill me in on that? You want to know my end game, Marty? I'll tell you my end know. game. You're a little retard. You're a little invalid. You're going to jail. Like, I don't care what your end game is. You fail at everything. You talked about all these plans for years, and it literally fails every single time. So I'm asking what Jamie's end game is. Hey, you really, you really want to know my end game is? No, I don't, no. Care. I don't care what you think or what your plans are, because they, you literally, you literally fail at everything. You can't even, you can't even be quiet. You can't even have a conversation like a human being. You know what's funny, Marty? You say you don't care, but yet all your, all your video titles. All your Reddits have to do with me. That, that's that's no, really I, your, I you're really showing that you don't. Facts. I haven't. I have not been talking about you. As a matter of fact, uh, you had risky beg for a streamer link, and like I haven't been talking about you. You get jealous when I don't pay attention to you, but you're done. You're yesterday's news. You're going to jail. No one cares about you anymore. Nobody you can't cares. Say said before. There's the sick little man child rotting away in his attic, and everyone's tired of you. And that's the facts, man. No, everyone's really tired is. of your ass. Okay. That's the truth, Marty. Everyone hates you. No one wants you, and honestly, there's a lot of people that wish that you were dead. And guess what? I'm, I'm, sure, I'm sure that that's true. Like, sorry, like you're gonna, so I'm getting less viewers now that you're on here. Um, I'm getting less money now that you're on here. Is there anything you want to like wrap it up with? Like, do you have anything you want to say? Like, I'm, I'm losing interest in you. I'm, I'm having fun exposing your ass for the piece of shit you are. Oh, he so, doesn't want to leave. So, so far, He's like, but I'm having fun. Let, let me have fun. I allegedly have gotten pepperoni jerk off videos out of you. Like, that's not even true, but I would say you're exposing yourself more than anything in side acts. You know, it's funny, Marty. It's pretty odd that you sit there and say and I am gonna let the I'm gonna let the chat figure this one out. I'm gonna I'm gonna let the chat come to their own conclusions on this. But for all y'all in chat, I want y'all to think about this for a moment. Don't you guys find it pretty weird at how Marty sits there and says that he doesn't remember that, but yet during that time period. No, I, so look, I, I was trying to get you to go down the process of how you were compelled to jerk off with pepperoni right. it and send it to a person on the internet after you get caught shoving things up your ass, after you get caught shoving things down your pee hole. Like, wouldn't you question maybe this is, maybe this is a ploy? Maybe this is just a, the same old. As Jimmy says, okie doke. Like, yeah, he just he falls for the okie doke. Does that happen before you realize? You know what? Maybe it's not a woman on the other end, or maybe they're just trying to expose me for being sick, degenerate, uh, and maybe they're not actually turning on my pepperoni. They just want to make a fool out of me for the thousandth time. Like, how does that not run through your head, Cyrax? <laughs> uh, hey, Marty, 
you know, it doesn't. Whatever, it doesn't you know, run through you, his you, head. You, you should, you should seriously be a stand-up comedian, man. Cause your comedy, your comedy is so fucking hilarious. Really you're so delusional that you're, you, dude. Like you, you, you you're you like you, you're so fucking delusional. Oh, it's actually so funny. Correct. I mean, Marty, why don't you, why don't you tell the truth, man? Why, why, why are you sitting there talking about me? How about we talk about you and how you blackmailed me by phone call, celeb voice messages on my mom's phone? Blackmailing me. How, how'd that tell, tell how'd that mom, happen? Telling me and my mom how if I don't do what you want, certain things are gonna happen. Certain things are gonna happen. Oh, you're making me do this. Oh, you're making me do that. Oh, if you don't do this, this is gonna happen. I mean, it's pretty ironic. Oh, oh, is that how he talks? Pepperoni jerk off video. Yeah, it is actually, Marty. Can... Well, so you said that I pretend to be a girl. So, like, I, so a girl contacted you and said, "Hey, Cyrax, if you don't do this and that, I'm gonna go after you and your family." Oh. Exactly what you did, and you know it. Yeah. Exactly... Marty's Marty's a uh, girl girl voice is on point there. Perfect, perfect, dude. What you did, Marty, and you know it. God, he's so fucking That's exactly what you did, bro, and you know it, man. Marty, let's be honest. Yeah. You're a fucking terrorist scumbag. And like I said, when myself and the Shadow Collective come after you and shut you and CBG and William Glory fag down and all your little cult friends. Alright, so I wrap it up here. I'm getting tired of you. People are going weary of your mental illness and your rambling like yeah he just re repeats and repeats and repeats and repeats mm -hmm. it's so annoying no 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 to my mom's on her voicemail. No. Why, why don't you explain to them how you called her a cunt? Left her a voicemail on her it's phone, fun. being it's nasty fun. as fuck. I want to take that back. Your mother is a burnt up retard, and your granny's a cunt. And let me correct myself on that one. Yep. Ah, that right there just shows that you're a piece of shit, oh, and that you do well, not fuck it's the truth, sir. Let's be honest, burger boy. I mean, you Burger murdered boy. three people. What? You murdered two prostitutes. My good friend Jamie Nicole. So, I've never Burger boy. Of any of that, Cyrax? Because it's not true. You would think that maybe I would have been arrested. Maybe there'd be some sort of investigation, but there wasn't. And you wanna know what's funny? I know why you tried to have me killed because you knew damn well that I was exposing you. So you paid someone else to try to kill me. Where did and Burger Boy person, come from? And that the motherfucker that showed up here in that mask. He's the motherfucker that you paid. <laughs> the world's worst hitman. To show up here to kill him because you knew damn well. You knew damn well that if. Do you like think at all before you say things? Or I don't think like so. Thoughts no. In your mind? You spit it out. Okay, so it's like seriously, like let's put a wrap on it here. It's getting old. You're, you're never gonna change. Oh, what's the matter, Marty? You mad because I'm exposing you? Is that why you're running? Because you're scared? You pussy motherfucker. I, I thought you were a tough guy. I thought you were a badass. Why are you running? Why are you being a <laughs> punk bitch? Why are you running, scared boy? I've just heard scared this for years. Scared cat motherfucker. Yo. I've heard this for years. Like, Cyrax, there's a reason the police call you a mentally ill person. Yep, 43. a 43. You know, 100%. I mean, there's a reason you're 23 in high school. There's a reason that you're going to get put into a group home. And that's because you're insane. No, it's because you pay them off. They're corrupt. You pay those motherfuckers. That's, that's Does he really think that, that... That's why you got away with assaulting me, Marty, because you paid them off. Right. There are a couple of Akron PD officers that are corrupt. Because, see, you, I, I have it all figured out. You and William work together with the Akron PD to make me look right. like a 43. You pay them off. What? Because you don't want to get in trouble. Is because he serious he right now? Anything go wrong for him because daddy was always there to bail your ass out. 
So wow. now that daddy's not around, wow. you have to resort to paying out the cops with your fucking bullshit ass fucking terroristic money that you get off your terrorist pedo little fucking the followers. What do I pay the cops? Nah, face it, Marty. You get paid by your followers. You yeah. get paid by your little cult followers to do what you do. That's how you rail the not shut the fuck up. That's how you were able to pay out the jobs. Just keep that. That's how, that, that's how you're doing all this, Marty. Yeah. And what? I'm telling you right now, He is so lost. I'm telling wow. you right now, fat fuck. Myself and the Shadow Collective are telling for you. You and everyone. You, so William, everyone. All of us. Alex, how long have you been telling me that you're going to get me locked up or that you're going to get me... Like, ever since I've known you, nothing's ever happened. Like, when is this... At some point, it's... I, you got to consider, is this ever going to happen, right? You should. Ah, uh, here's the thing. Now it's fine. When, when, when this current case is over, trust me when I say it, Marty. Trust me when I like say it. It's going to be happening. Last hundred times it failed. What makes you think that this time is going to be any different? A lot sooner it's... than you think, pal. Well, okay. It's really going to be happening a lot sooner than you think. So it's all I have to say to you is this. All right, goodbye, Sarx. See you later. Bye, pedophile. All right. Pedo boy. Kitty did what a little bit. All right. Kitty did what Marty. Yeah. Have yeah. fun rotting away. Oh my god. Guy was a complete nutcase. Like, He's Marty's a saint. He guy's completely exhausting. I I wouldn't be able to talk to him for that long without. I would probably spurg out. Like I don't know. This guy is is something else. Um. Yeah, I can't. I can't stand him. He, he seems to be getting a little bit desperate. Yeah. Um. One hundred.